crime and criminal justice have become central issues for candidates. While political figures like Donald Trump and Kamala Harris emphasize tough-on-crime rhetoric, experts Sarah Rosen Wardle and David Pitts argue that long-term safety depends on shifting resources away from mass incarceration and toward community-based programs. Using cities like Philadelphia and Baltimore as examples, they highlight the success of violence intervention programs that focus on economic stability and early intervention. They urge policymakers to look at data-driven solutions rather than relying on outdated strategies like long prison sentences, which have proven ineffective at preventing crime and disproportionately harm communities of color. How effective do you believe community violence intervention programs are in reducing crime? Do you think reallocating funds from prisons to community programs could lead to a safer society?